Welcome to Unit 10 of Systematic Theology 1. In this unit we're going to be discussing a topic that is not at all controversial, the topic that no one has ever argued or fought about in the history of evangelical life at all, and that is the topic of the providence of God. How much control does God have over all things, and do human beings have genuine free will? Never once has anyone ever debated this topic. Obviously, I'm lying. This is a very debated topic, a topic that um, will, I'm sure, provoke some very interesting discussion along the way. But what we're going to talk about here is the providence of God in general terms. We're not yet to the point where we will be in Systematic 2 where we're talking about more specific things like um, how, doc how God's providence relates to election, how God's providence relates to predestination, so on and so forth. Here we're just talking in general terms about providence. Does, does God determine and control absolutely every single thing that happens? Um, does He cause every single thing to happen? Um, does He decree every single thing to happen? Or does God work in such a way with human beings where He allows human beings to have a sort of genuine libertarian freedom whereby they make choices on their own and respond to God appropriately. And so, again, this is, this is a, a, a hotly debated um, issue and topic. And what you'll be doing um, in, in this week's reading is you'll be reading, really, um, uh, from three different Calvinistic perspectives. Um, Millard Erickson's position, um, which is sort of a moderate Calvinist position, Wayne Grudem, which is a uh, a more traditional five-point Calvinistic view. And Greg Allison, who is himself a Calvinist, will be uh, talking about this issue historically. You'll be reading um, from different sides in his particular section on this issue in his historical theology book. And uh, of course in the notes you will be reading from, from not only these guys, but you'll also be reading from well-known Arminian theologians like Thomas Oden and others. And so we want to try to give you a sort of a balanced introduction to what I think is a very important issue. Because it's an issue that relates to the problem of evil, why we deal with pain and suffering in this world. But it's also an issue that has some existential concerns. Is God really in control? Can I really trust Him to answer my prayer when I call on Him? Is God really working the difficult things out in my life for His good, for my good and for His glory? So, I mean, the Prov Doctrine of Providence is a very important topic, and I think we'll have a lot of fun reading these materials this week. So there's um, things to read, there's notes, and there's a quiz at the end of this section. And I've also included a little funny video uh, that related to the doctrine of prayer you might appreciate.